Well, in a surprise move, Yogesh Agarwal has stepped down as the chairman of the Pension Fund Regulatory and Development Authority. Priyal joins us from the capital with uh, what could have led to this move. Well, it seems to be an abrupt departure from his role as the chairman of the Pension Fund uh, Regulatory and Development Authority, the PFRD, the pension regulator of the country, especially after the PFRD bill essentially really just recently got uh, not from the parliament and took, uh, in September this year. And therefore, a larger uh, role as far as PFRD is concerned is uh, to take place. Yogesh Agarwal, uh, who resigned from his post as of today as per the government notification, uh, all Almost resigned uh, uh, about two years before his tenure ends. He joined the PFRDA uh, in June 2010 and was to retire after the five-year completion of five-year term. Uh, there were, of course, uh, reports, uh, and there was essentially uh, the post of uh, whole time members for which there were vacancies that were, uh, and uh, the search was being conducted by the Ministry of Finance. But interestingly, as reports suggest, uh, that the PFRDA chairman was not part of this selection committee which generally is a situation when the chairman heads uh, the committee where the members of the regulatory reg, of a regulator is uh, looked into or is uh, the selection committee sits into so that that was a curious case there when the chairman was not part uh, of uh, this very selection committee but and as it appears now uh, that the PFRDA ha chairman has resigned uh, Anup Vadhavan who is uh, who is the joint secretary in the department of the financial services takes over from him as the interim chairman of the PFRDA. We still have to get uh, more details as to what really were the reasons for this early departure.